um, as far as I'm concerned, I don't want to be a pessimist, but I can't see any concrete um, concrete move right now because it seems we don't even understand basic economics. Our leaders don't understand basic economics. Uh, I'm not saying that um, I understand it more than they should, but at least I understand what should work and what they are doing presently that is not working. Let me give you a, a, a very quick example, right? Recently, I think it was uh, late February, uh, the CBN had the um, periodic uh, monetary policy rate uh, meeting. Mm. And um, what they did was actually very surprising to me. The CRL, which is what, the what, that? Um, cash reserve ratio, okay, that dictates how much the bank should have as cash reserve yeah. with the CBN that they do not touch mm. to manage their liquidity, yeah. right? It was increased from 32.5% to 45%, right? Now, what this means is that when you are increasing cash reserve ratio, CRL, what you are trying to do is, it's supposed to be a inflationary, um, oh. inflationary uh, measure to, yeah. you know, reduce the cash supply in the in, pop, in the in the, um, in the system yeah mm -hmm. in the system so when cash supply reduces right um obviously if there is less cash in the system there will be uh well technically there's supposed to be a reduction in uh, prices yeah but it doesn't work that way if you understand the nigerian economy because it is not just one policy that you have to look at you have to look at multiplicity of policies now, alongside increase of CRL to 45%, the monetary policy rate was also increased to 22.75%. Now, when you are increasing monetary policy rates, that means automatically lending rates will increase. Yeah. Because the monetary policy rate is a benchmark for lending rates. Mm. So, what happens when lending rates increases? A lot of people are discouraged to lend money from the banking system. Yeah. That's what it means. Because if the rates are high, people will not want to lend money from the banking system. And what happens when people are not lending? You are not growing the economy. You are not growing the economy because people are not assessing funds to grow the economy. You are squeezing funds out of the system what else are you putting in place to grow the economy in terms of productivity? Because you cannot grow your GDP, your GDP gross domestic product, without uh, productivity. Mm. Productivity is a direct uh, impactor on, yeah. on your GDP gross domestic product. Do you understand? Yeah. And everything that is supposed to grow GDP, you are squeezing. Now I'll ask you something, because I have the facts. I might not be able to give you the people right now. There has been no point that the government has actually increased monetary policy rates and actually also increased cash reserve ratio, and it has directly impacted, had a positive impact that was visibly seen, right? Inflation in the country. Yeah. Let me shock you. 